I'm MightMouth74 and this is a Transformers video review. For the Transformers community, please subscribe to MightMouse74. Hey, what's going on, Mouseketeers? Might Mouse 74 at the Transformers Video Review from Transformers 4 Age of Extinction. This is Deluxe Class Scorn. So, on the back here, you get a brief bio which reads Scorn has the jaws of a dino and a personality of a tank. He's a rumbling, thundering warhammer on legs. Also available, Bumblebee, Dinobot Slug. Here, Scorn is robot mode. His tail becomes a spear, and here's Scorn in his Spinosaurus mode. So I think that about does it for the box. Without further ado, let's get Scorn out of here and see what he's all about. Okay, so here we have Scorn in his Spinosaurus mode. He does come with his little dagger, which you can store on the bottom of Scorn. In Dino mode, there's a groove underneath the tail. You can take the dagger and put that on the inside, just like that. You can also have Scorn in a much better standing position. You can take the claws on the front and just bring them back like that. Then do the same with the other side. Take the claw right there and just bring it all the way back. And he stands a lot better like that. So for details of Scorn in Spinosaurus mode, he has mostly red paint details. His mouth is dark gray paint details, which can also open and close. He has some articulations in the head. You can move it side to side. His eyes is light blue paint details. He has some orange paint details there, there, and just a little back here. He has a silver Autobot logo just in the center right there. The tail is like a red metallic color and it blends into a light gray on the back. The, uh, the spines has some red paint details and it blends into a lighter gray on the top. He also has some more orange paint details here, here, and right there. So now for comparison in Dino Mode, here we have Scorn. And here we have Tail Whip Scorn. So to go ahead and transform Scorn into his robot mode, you want to start at the top. These rubber bits here, they're plugged in on the top of the body here and right there. You can actually move this back, which makes it easier to unpeg. Then from there, all you have to do is rotate that to the side. Do the same with this one. Just rotate this to the side, just like that. With the legs, you want to bring this panel down like that, and then do the same with the other leg. Bring this panel down just like that. The legs can move back and forth, so all you have to do is just straighten out the, the other legs like that. Do the same with the other leg. Just kind of straighten it out like that. And then just unplug this like that, and then bring this part down just like so. And you pretty much have the legs done in robot mode. From here, you want to rotate the body, and when doing so, it has just a little bit of an automorph feature with the head. Just rotate this like that, and then kind of bring the head up all the way. This piece here, there's a tab underneath there, and all you have to do is just tab it into place nice and tight. Just like that, kind of, again, straighten out the legs so they're nice and straight. On the back of Scorn, you can have the dino arms like that, or you can bring it up and have the dino arms tucked in on the back just like that, just kind of so they're out of the way and whatnot. From here, you want to take the dino head and open up the mouth as wide as you can. And then you want to rotate the dino head around like this, which you can bring the arm down with the fist. You want to bring the fist all the way out until it clicks into place. You'll be able to hear it once you do it. 
bring this down like that, and then rotate this down like this, and here you pretty much have Scorn in his robot mode. With Scorn's hidden weapon feature, you can take the dagger on the side of the arm, which is the tail, and just bring it out like that. You can have him hold it. There's a hole in the fist of Scorn. Plug it in like that, and there you go. So let's have a closer look at the figure and his details. Here's an up close headshot. Now for comparison in robot mode, here we have Scorn, and here we have Tail Whip Scorn. Now to transform Scorn back to Dino mode, you want to take the fist and rotate the fist back up just like that. And then with the Dino head, you want to close the mouth all the way, and then you want to rotate at the head just like this, and then this gray bit here, you want to have it so it's flush, so you want the head almost on an angle, like that, and then bring the head up just like this, and then with the other side, you want this, rotate it around, just like that for now. Then with the back side, you just want to take this and kind of just loosen this up away from the body, just like that, and leave it like that for now. Then from here, you can rotate the body like this, you can even push down the head. Make sure you push it down all the way. With these rubber spines here, you want to tab them on the top of the body just like that. Do the same with the other one. Just rotate it and then you can tab it. There's two tabs, one there, one there, and then two tab holes there and there. Just tab it in there just like so. And then from here with the dino arms, and I'm going to show you the best that I can there's a dark gray peg hole right there and a light gray peg right there. And all you have to do is take the dino arms and peg it into place just like that. On the back side of Scorn, there's a rubber peg right there on the tail and a peg hole right there. And all you have to do, just make sure you line it up and you should be able to feel it grab into place just like so. With the legs, you can now go ahead and flip these up like that and then come to the other side and pretty much do the same thing. Just flip that up just like that. The legs can move back and forth. So all you have to do is just move the legs back then tuck the legs in just like that and then pretty much do the same thing on the other side. Move the leg up and tuck it in just like so. And here we now have Transformers 4 Age of Extinction Deluxe Class Scorn back into Spinosaurus mode. So that about wraps it up. This is Mike Mouse 74 and you've just seen from Transformers 4 Age of Extinction, this is Deluxe Class Scorn with a totally cool and yet simple transformation. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, support the mouse, support your Transformers community. Stay tuned for lots more reviews to come. Join me and all my friends on my Facebook group called The Mousetrap. If anybody wants to join, I'll put a link down below. You can also follow me on Twitter. I'll put a link down below. I want to thank everybody for watching. And as always, guys, take care, everyone.